That song you're listening to right now is on the brand new album from award-winning multi-platinum country superstar Sarah Evans. The album of cover songs called Copy That is something you need to listen to. I had a chance to sit down with Sarah to talk to her about her new book titled Born to Fly, and I learned that she was born to sing and a whole lot more. Superstar, this beautiful, soulful, passionate voice. I feel so honored to talk to you. First of all, how are you doing? I'm glad you're on our show. Thank you. I'm doing great. I'm so excited to be on your show, and um, thanks for having me. You've been on stage singing, I think, before you could even read, if I'm right, about four or five years old. Do people know that about you? I mean, you really are comfortable because you've been doing it your whole life. Yeah, I mean, they do now that the memoir's out, and I talk extensively about, you know, growing up on stage. Um, I was four years old. My older brother started taking guitar lessons, and my parents just, I'm, I can only, like, I always picture them, like, looking at each other, like, oh, my God, she can sing, and they, they're talented. By the time I was six or seven, I was leading a band full of men and telling them what key I wanted to sing in and how I wanted the song to go. Um, and I'm so grateful for that because that experience, you know, gave me all the confidence that I needed when I got to Nashville. And who has that much time? And how you, know, you have had not one, but two brushes with death. One when you were a child and then again on a plane as an adult. Mm -hmm. um, when you think back to those times and, and just how scary that must have been, do you feel like that's some uh, that has to do with the depth of the, the passion when you sing, like, like it comes from those experiences. When I got hit by a car, I spent six weeks in the hospital and that changed my life. It changed my view, I think, on everything in life. The car was going 75 miles an hour and I had no, you know, internal injuries, just broken bones and a concussion. But it definitely, um, that was the first like big drama in my life. And then, you know, my parents divorcing and well, I don't know what came first. Like, I don't know if I create drama because I'm a musician or, or I'm a good musician because there's drama. <laughs> you know what, either way it's working for you because yeah. <laughs> your voice is just so good and you keep selling albums, which is great. What have you learned about yourself during the pandemic? I have learned that I have no patience. Um, I have no tolerance for anything. And um, I've learned how much I absolutely love and appreciate being on the road, my fans coming to the concerts. Um, my entire career, you know, or the 90% of my career, my income, everything is based on doing live shows. And all of those have been canceled. We were going to do 80 shows this year. Um, yeah, I, I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, it's okay. You know, I know that. I mean, it's, it's been very difficult. Um, but at the same time, I do have, I mean, I have learned to just be patient. And there are just some things that are out of your control. Um, and, you know, I spend a lot of time praying and asking God, you know, where are you? And and then there are other days where I'm like, I know you're here and you're always protecting and providing and you're you're never gonna leave or forsake us. So it's been a roller coaster of emotions. In your book, which is called Born to Fly, you talk about raising children and stepchildren and your marriage. If there's one lesson or one bit of advice that your now almost adult children could walk away with from you, what would you want that to be? I've raised my children with humor and Humor, I think, is everything. And I don't sweat the small stuff, you know, um, but all, all of my kids have learned to be funny. And I was raised that way as well. Country superstar Sarah Evans, we so much appreciate your time. Again, the memoir is called Born to Fly. And we hope to see you at a concert right here in San Diego soon. Thank you. Good stuff there.